Hey YouTube, what's up? Uh, it's Hunter again, and today as the title suggests, we're gonna look at my old phones. Let's get started. Disclaimer, all of my phones since I've had my first one have been on the same service. I'm on Straight Talk from Walmart. I pay $45 a month for unlimited talk, text, and 5 gigabytes of high-speed data. It's cheap and it's easy to use. Let's get started. So I got my first phone when I was 14 years old, on my birthday actually. Uh, my dad woke me up and was like, okay, we're going to Walmart, we're getting a phone. And I was like, yas bitch. Here it is, it's just a normal simple slider phone, it goes up like that. Uh, and here's a little close up. As you can see, it's just a slide up phone, it has the T9 texting. You know, like, if you wanted a TV, you'd hit 8 three times, and that's the camera on the back. It was kind of shitty quality, but uh, I never really used it anyway. So, on to the next phone. This phone. Uh, it is a Huawei, or however you say it, Ascend Pro Plus, something like that. And uh, it's broken as all hell because I smashed it on the sun outside in there. Here's a close up. So, as you can see, especially when I lift into light, there's a bunch of cracks going up. Uh, it's smashed right here at the bottom where you can see that big crack and kind of just went up uh, Here's the camera on the back again like the other one. It wasn't the best quality So last December when I got my first big check from work uh, It was amazing. I had almost 400. I had over 400 dollars in the bank And I was like, you know what? It's time for me to get a new phone. I'm gonna get me a good ass phone At this time the 6s plus had come out for the iPhone and I was like, well, I'm not gonna be able to afford one of those so I want to get a big phone to kind of mask it. So I got the Samsung Galaxy Grand Prime. It's five inches, and it was the first like big purchase I've ever made. And I loved this phone when I had it. It was only eight gigabytes though, which made me really sad compared to now when I have 32. Here's a close up. So as you can see, it has a five inch display, the little button like normal Samsung buttons do. It says Grand Prime at the bottom. The camera was actually pretty good, especially the video, the speaker right there. I didn't like how the headphone jack was on top, I don't really like phones like that. And this was my first phone with the charger port at the bottom. So after my side phone and my two Androids, I was like, okay, all of my friends have iPhones and I've always wanted one, so how can I get one? So I reached out online and I really wanted the 6S Plus, like I said. So in March of last year, uh, I bought one. I was like, okay, I want an iPhone, but I don't have enough for a 6S. So I got the next big thing. I did not get a 6S. I did not get a 6 Plus. I didn't get a 6. I got a 5S, which I thought was the next big thing. It was the first phone, iPhone with the touch sensor. It had a... Here's a close-up. So as you can see, this one has the first touch sensor. It had the button on top. This was my first phone with the charger port at the bottom, or the headphone jack at the bottom. And this was my first iPhone. And I came in gold, and I was—I really liked it. So now we're on my current phone. Uh, as I said a million times already, I really wanted the 6S Plus, but all of my friends were saying, "Don't get it. It's way too big. You're not gonna like it." So I took their advice and got the regular 6S. I love this phone. I got it in gold, just like my last one, and I could not be happier with the phone. I plan to get a 7 one day. Maybe not anytime soon. Maybe when the next one comes out, the iPhone 8 when the 7 becomes a lot cheaper, but uh, yeah, here's a close up. As you can see, it's bigger but smaller. My Grand Prime was 5 inches all the way down, this one's only 4.7, but it's not that much of a difference. Uh, the sensor, the volume, and this was not my first button with the lock screen on the side. I don't like how the camera lens kind of pops out though, but when you have a phone case on it like my current one, uh, you can't really tell. And I do how like they made the 6S able to make the flashlight brighter and dimmer. So that is all the phones that I've ever owned, and I hopefully plan to have more phones in the future. But yeah, that is all I got for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed, and here's a little announcement. I'm finally going to start a, a schedule, because I want to. I want to start making a schedule so people know when they can see my stuff and they can find it here. Now, I won't... I will be sticking to that schedule. I will be posting every Saturday, but if I have a video that I really want to post, I will be posting it throughout the week, too. Uh, those are just going to be like little specs. This video is just my announcement video. It is not going up on a Saturday. Today is Monday, 
happen, but there will be another video definitely on Saturday. I'm not sure what it'll be, maybe a collab. But uh, yeah, like this video if you liked it, and you can see that little red button down there, you might want to click it, because it says subscribe, and you'll be notified every time I every time I make a new video. So do all of that, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.